Hello everybody, welcome back to Kelvin's Coin TV. My name is Ross, this is Blood Omen, Legacy of Cain. We just finished Avernus Cathedral. Ariel is sending us up against William the Just. To do that, we have to go and talk to King Ottendorf. So here we go. The specter of Ariel led me to Willendorf. If I was to defeat the next member of the circle, I needed to understand his machinations. With this vague advice in mind, I set forth on the road to Willendorf. Good lord. Drink their blood, Cain. Do not give a crap about you guys. Willendorf, yep, that's where we want to go. Disguised as a chew, man. Strange, isn't it, Kane? That one cannot quite accept that which sustains him. You in your death, and me in mine. But death cannot reign in a world without life. And soon you will find the quest ahead of you is yours and yours alone. I can assist you no longer. Okay, Tony J. Whatever you think is best. What's up here? That didn't work at all. Oh. All right, let's give this dungeon a try. Tough fellow mortal peasants. <laughs> uh hmm. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, hey, take it easy. I suck your blood? That was harder. That was easier than it looked. Is what I was. Yep. Intelligence. Intelligence spewing forth from my mouth in this moment. Comprehensive thoughts. Full sentence structures. Insight and content. No, no. Speech 100. Thank you. Ow. Okay. Oh. 
Okay, so that's on the level below. I think that's what I'm here to get. I can't mind control that guy, can I? Across the way? No. I can mind control you! soul from its body, leaving its vacant flesh mine to control. Hmm. It was just an improved version of, uh... I'm confused about how it's different. Control mind. Spirit rack. Okay. It is an approved version of a uh, brain spell. Okay. Mind control specters now. Oh. Ah, I see. Okay. Moving on, word. Come on. Cost so much mana. Whoa. Whoa. I waste all my energy banks doing this. It literally takes like all my mana. Uh that orb helps in the short term. Jesus. Nuts. Should really be wearing my bone armor for this, shouldn't I? That's a swell idea. You know what? I think those things come back, so... Jerks? Okay. Give me the orb! Well, more energy banks, and then okay, we can go this way. Oh my god! <laughs> 
Cool. Uh, the police were going to. Whatever it was called, I already forgot. King Ottendorf's castle. Palace. Ottendorf city. Willendorf. Willendorf. Proud defender of the realm with its warrior elite and mighty ruler, King Ottmar. The Lion Throne had once held my allegiance, but Willendorf's days of glory had passed. It was the last bastion against an unruly future. Okay. Here we go. King Otmar has for us. It would seem that only those of noble lineage were allowed to pass through the illustrious gates of Willendorf Castle, and the enchantment I had cast with my disguise was not enough to fool these soldiers of hope. I would need a stronger illusion to beguile them. Okay. All right, all right. Where's the island? Right here. Okay. Ooh. Oh, I've been waiting for this. Hearts of Darkness, thank you. Oh, he splits the D. What's this? Mighty Willendorf had sliced open the belly of the earth, reaping a bounty of precious metals and unearthing ancient secrets. Of these secrets, I had heard of a tomb that contained an ancient forefather of King Otmar himself. Within the tomb, a fountain of blood would allow me to cast the most noble of illusions and gain entry to the city of the mighty lion. Great. Can I push these boulders? Oh, no, I cannot. No! There's a fountain somewhere that lets me uh, push heavy boulders, and I unfortunately have to do that before I can do this. Bye. Ow, come on! Oh, I don't have nearly enough spell points for this. <laughs> oh my god, land, get there! Get there! Oh boy. Alright, so we're back at the Stonehenge. We're at a Stonehenge. I think this is the one I've already been to. Whoa! Hey! Haven't been here. This is cool. Found the way I have not gone. Success. The 
Ha, this is exactly where I want to be. Skip you. Mighty will. Yep. Here. The blood of ages flows so sweet. Come drink from us. Your strength has increased for our blood enhances. Fantastic. We can push the big rocks now. We big and buff. Hey, Beguile. Great. All right, let's do the, uh... Let's do the Beguile cave. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Take it easy. Drink from two people at once by double tapping the drink button and holding the second tap. Huh. I didn't know that. Thanks for the tip. Relatively easy. This is immensely easy. Well, it's relatively easy in relation to Avernus Cathedral, Malik's Bastion. Which have been the two hardest parts of the game so far, for me at least. Malik's, Malik's Bastion, because they didn't give you a lot of ways to replenish life. The blood of ages flows so sweet. Come drink from us. Sure will. Unlike the Mask of Disguise, this spell actually allows me to cast away the guise of death for a time, allowing me to walk among the living undisturbed. The spell also provides a visage of nobility, for there are many who would easily divulge more to those of highborn blood. The court of King Otmar. Shades of my former existence, proud and self-absorbed, surrounded by all the finery of the realm, secure in their ignorance. As I walked among them, I smirked, thinking of the carnage that would befall them at the hands of the legions of the Nemesis, the glorious flames, and the inevitable rape and pillage. Out of my way, peasant! The stench of the fields hangs over you like a pall. The king sees no one. He is in mourning for the princess. He'll be in mourning for his kingdom soon, and he'll mourn for you even sooner if you don't get out of my way. And so I won my audience, such as it was, with Otmar. He cared not for the invading armies from the north, only of the plight of his child. Her birthday present. To celebrate her birthday, I declared a contest. Whoever created the finest doll in the realm would be granted a royal favor. Hundreds of dolls were brought, but the winner was obvious. Elzevir, the doll maker, created a toy of such beauty that all were captivated by it. And all he would take in payment was a lock of her hair. Soon after, she became like this, a lifeless puppet. Whoever restores her to her former self shall have this kingdom. Thus, my hunt for the Dollmaker began. My daughter. I fear I shall never hear her delicate laugh again. Oh. Creepy. Otmar slumped on his throne like a rag doll, his beard matted with tears of his own self-pity. In my court, he would have long since been usurped by one stronger, but in Willendorf, they worshipped him, even in his weakness. I wondered what Willendorf would do when Otmar's death finally arrived. There's a door to the way. I never went this way. Save point. 
Fantastic. Don't know who that was. items over there it's on the other side of the fort maybe the items down there as well Monkeys. There are a lot of them. Good thing I discovered that I could uh, drink all their blood, because I did exactly what I did. I went and did exactly that. Alright, let's see what's in this tower. Whoa, whoa, take it easy. He exploded. Item that stunned people. Most of the items just kind of like, you know, make them blow up. <laughs> All right, so that point there. Ching. Heck yeah. I'm okay taking one hit because when I drink blood of one person, it kind of replenishes that life we lost with the hit. This was once the most academic of cities, housing some of the most prestigious universities in all of Nosgoth. While I would not weep over lost tomes, I detested the sight of scars left upon the world at the hands of the nemesis. I mean, Kane is showing some remorse over the dying nature of Nosgoth, but I don't know if he's always going to be that way. Do not have a lot of spell points left. Like, squeeze me? Wow, okay. Disguising yourself as a noble. That won't work. That won't work. Mace is really effective against 
any human, apparently. Good to know. Say journey was tomorrow this weekend. It's Friday. I might have misspoke. We're gonna play Journey on Friday at 22 hours Greenwich Mean Time, which is 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you're in the northeastern United States, like I am. Ooh. I think we had to eventually come this way. It was interesting. Oh, I get it. Sorry. I'm just putting together who these soldiers are. These these guys are soldiers of the Nemesis, I think. <laughs> Oops, didn't mean to kill him. You know, it stinks. It's going to be a full moon. So we're going to miss the, uh, that funny, fanciful door opening. What do you guys rather, what, rather we do? Because I can fly there. I can't do that. Let me just see if there's another, uh, bat landmark on the other side of this. That would be very helpful. Anything over here? Eight days, four to full, to new, then four back to full. Gotcha. Thank you for that, Captain Stinky. Been a huge help today. Been an honor to meet you and the other new chatters. And of course, Leo, Carveco, Birdman, the usual crowd. Great to see you as well. Oh, we're running out of time if we want to <laughs> get to the, uh, the moon door. Okay, that's definitely the nemesis. Look what sword he's got. I'll tell you what, this is not the doll maker's house. That's for dang sure. Could be that way though. Some kind of construct. All right, so we found the house, it looks like. How do we get past the door? Oh, crap. We got reassembling skill, mans. Oh, burn them. That makes perfect sense. Excuse me. Well, that's definitely a dollmaker's house right there. If I've ever seen one. However do we open the door? I'm going to check on... Ooh. That lever probably opens this door. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. You know what? As a special treat. Let's go. That's not the way into the dollhouse anyway. It was right here, right? Oh yeah, baby. Here we go. This is interesting. Oh my god, it's another werewolf. Oh my god, I hate you. Jerkwood.
Let's throw it out. Heart of Darkness, don't mind if I do that switch, you mean, right? Whoa. Ow. There we go. Thank you for that. I totally missed it. The Heart of Darkness. I'm blowing it. just so the slow as a darkness I don't understand how you can run so fast as a werewolf but attack so slowly oh god this is helpful very timely have to be a werewolf. Jeepers, crow. Uh, great. More of these puzzles. Jesus Christ. The heart of darkness. Unreal. using the shields a little more. Okay. Switch on the other side. Oh, 
Still not as rage-inducing as the, uh... Scenario 7 from Price of Loyalty? Yeah, you're absolutely right. This isn't... Are you kidding me? Oh, I wasn't in mist form. I was... I have a shield on, not mist. Ross, you're an idiot. Think. Stupid Price of Loyalty got me again. <laughs> Oh, lightning. With this spell, I can call upon the heavens to tear my enemies apart with its explosive power. Oh, how their bodies will rupture as the scything energy rips through them. Uh, cool. That sounds like fun. Can we give that a try? All right, so that was the big get from doing that. Back in Kane's mausoleum, we're gonna go back to the doll maker's house in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching Kelvin's Coin, everybody. My name is Ross. This has been Blood Omen: Legacy of Kane. We'll see you in the next episode. Bye.